Hello, my name's Victoria. I'm a mum of five in the UK. And these videos are filmed a couple of weeks in advance, so I don't know what will be going on in the world by the time you see this. Hopefully things will settle down. But at the time of filming this, the riots in the UK have been going on for about a week and we've generally just fed up and had four years of crap from our government. <laughs> so I just wanted to say... The mothers have always had to protect their children through hard times. Mothers have always had to worry about their children and carry on and do their best. But the internet and social media are relatively new and we haven't always had to have negativity and hatred and bad news and constant fear mongering shoved in our eyeballs 24 hours a day so if you need to step well, you're not made for that so if you need to step away from that and just focus on your own what's going on in your own four walls then that's probably the wisest thing you can do it's not cowardice or putting your, your head in a bucket of sand it's protecting yourself and making so you're healthy enough and your well-being strong enough to look after your children. And don't think you're not doing anything important by just looking after the house and the children. By sticking to the general flow of family life or any routines you've got, like breakfast, dinner and tea, or um, tea time, bath time, bedtime story... You know what I mean? The general flow of life, what you're actually doing is creating little islands of stability for your children, things that will make them feel safe and secure. People talk about motherhood like it's not the most important job in the world and it's something that you can put off or just pick up and drop down whenever you want, but it is the most important thing in the world. And if the state of this world tells us anything, it tells us that raising the next generation of human beings is the most important job because we need a decent generation of human beings to come on after us that aren't going to mess things up like we are, that are going to make things better. So the most important thing you can do for yourself and your kids is to love each other make the best of things, protect each other from the negativity, carry on as normal as much as you can, enjoy life as much as you can, protect yourselves as much as you can and just be thankful for the people out there who are fighting for our freedoms, who are um, have our interests at heart, like now, like in the World War Two, like whenever, so that we can stay at home and look after our children, put our best foot forward and carry on as best as we can. That's all I wanted to say, really. I hope that makes sense and it's some sort of comfort. Um, oh, this is me when the kids are in bed, having a bit of time, protecting myself, keeping my, keeping my, what's it called? Keeping my tick, not ticker up, keeping my something up. <laughs> I've been watching you rang, my lord. I've been finding lots of the old stuff very comforting at the moment. So if you like that video, please subscribe. I'm full of what I think are wise words that are probably nonsense. <laughs> yeah, look after yourselves. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.